Maya and welcome back to another video. Before I begin, I'd like to thank HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. A few days ago, I was sent a parcel from HelloFresh and I've not tried it before. And it's basically food packages with different meal plans included. So you can literally go onto the HelloFresh website, pick different meal plans, and they supply you with all the ingredients, which is fresh produce as well, whether it's meat, veg, whatever sort of dietary plan that you have and also the recipe to cook a meal. And I found it really interesting and really cool. And it's also very convenient that it saves you having to go shopping or if you're not sure what to cook, you have so many different ideas. And if you're interested in learning something new, there's all different recipes to learn how to cook different meals. So there's so many different plans to suit your needs and it's also so convenient that it's literally delivered to your door. So I've been trying some really nice meals the past week and in today's video I cook up the lovely curry that you'll see later on. If you're interested in HelloFresh then you can get your first parcel with 50% off and the next three parcels after that with 35% off using my code here and you literally just click in the link in the description. Thank you so much, I hope you enjoy the video, here it is, I've really enjoyed filming it.
what a lovely evening it has been so nice i'm so chilled nice to be back out in the woods doing some bushcraft bits i'm absolutely buzzing with my bushcraft spain set up with the uh, canvas tarp and the wall blanket absolutely amazing it will be my first night sleeping in the twin wall blanket and the canvas tarp so i'm really excited see how it goes it's meant to be dropping down to five degrees tonight so uh, I've got my anorak I've got a fire going it's not that close to where I'm sleeping but it should reflect a bit of heat it's just started raining as well so I'm nice and covered and what's so brilliant about the canvas is I know this fire isn't going to burn a hole in it and it actually holds the heat around this area so nicely I've been dying to get hold of uh, some bushcraft Spain stuff and I'm so happy that I've got the the blanket and the canvas tarp so I had my chicken curry it was like a coconut chicken curry it was absolutely amazing Good morning, just got a brew on. The fire was already going from last night. There was a few embers still lit. So I just chucked a few shavings on and it just took off, which was perfect. Got my bush pot on, gonna boil some water. Honestly, so happy with the performance of um, the Bushcraft Spain stuff. It did drop quite a bit in the night, but I slept with Pretty much all the clothes I've got on and then went inside the blanket but it's honestly so nice to be back out I just I haven't done this sort of thing for ages I've been doing mainly like hiking bike packing trips or trips with other people so just being here in the woods on my own and just doing bushcraft and simple things it's just so wholesome and so good for your soul you realize how little you actually need when you start setting up like this obviously you need food and water and over a long time i think you need company but it's just it's ideal and you feel so much healthier and happier when you're outside
Right, on with the bushcraft bacon. So I've just got two V-sticks, sort of crossbar and whacked that on for breakfast. Weather is absolutely stunning. This camp out has been beautiful. I've loved it. So just before I pack up, I just wanted to explain about the wool blanket. It's basically, you can have it in different configurations, but I decided to have mine just in half. So it sort of sandwiched me last night. And at the bottom of the blanket, I have put two pins in so it just stops my feet from slipping out and it sort of forms a sleeping bag sort of design but so warm, really comfy. And what's amazing about this, it doesn't really get damp like a down bag would. And if it gets a bit of rain on it, then it tends to keep the heat. I've also just put a little mat on the floor just to stop any cold coming up from the ground. And the tarp definitely reflected the heat and kept me super warm, super dry, because it did rain last night. I love this plow point configuration. It's been amazing just to be near the fire, under shelter, but also looking out. Thank you so, so much for watching this video and thank you to all my Patreons for making this possible that are listed in the description. Take care.